always wondered, what do you expect me to look like? My name is Alice Deering, I'm 22 years old and I'm the only black person swimming for Britain on a senior international level. Alice Deering, the first black swimmer in Britain's Olympic team, uses and promotes the sole cap, an extra large swim cap designed specifically to protect Afro hair and larger hairstyles, but she has been forbidden from wearing it in Tokyo. Having Afro hair, it's quite difficult to maintain. Like I said, it is a bit of a, like a full-time job. Um, and unless obviously you plait it back or you get cornrows or whatever, it's, not, it's just not going to um, work in those regular swimming caps because um, of how strong and tough her hair is. So I think, yeah, now that those sole caps have been developed, it's, you know, it's making that a little bit easier to come into swimming. I just braid it every month, so then I don't have to like bother, really. But the chlorine ruins it anyway. The decision to ban the sole cap has spotlighted a lack of diversity in swimming. Everybody in England has the right to swim. We want them to feel comfortable coming to the pool, regardless of race, gender, background, faith, or whatever. And any barrier, any barrier that's in place can prevent that. And if you're told you can't wear that hat that absolutely suits your hairstyle, that's a barrier. That makes you not want to come. FINA, which oversees international competitions in swimming, rejected the application from the British makers of the sole cap. It, however, says it is now in talks and we'll review the application again later this year. But for now, attention would shift to Deering as she competes in the Olympic women's 10,000 marathon swim on Wednesday. When I was younger, there was a girl at swimming who set joint missions of making swimming more accessible for people.